Good morning, Light fans. Welcome back to Brick Rose. Uh, in case of the, those of you who are still curious of what's uh, going on, why I've changed my appearance, uh, please check the video uh, on my main dashboard of my channel. Anyway, uh, today I wanted to showcase another mod of mine, uh, something that's near and dear to my heart, the uh, the old, old school Lido minifigures. No, no, I'm not talking about, you know, figures like me. I'm talking about figures like these. The old school Lido <coughs> minifigures, the big figures I like to call them, but you know, that has different connotations these days. Anyway, these guys uh, were mostly brick built, and uh, as such, I really enjoy the creativity that uh, goes into making these guys. Uh, just a, kind of a bummer when you're when you run out of arms or something, you know, somebody's, uh, somebody's gonna be uh, a little disappointed. <laughs> so anyway, um, this is basically what I uh, wanted to make a mock out of. I wanted to use make a mock using these figures, something a little different, um, and try to mix it up a little bit, you know, with my building style and uh, some of the random, uh, random, you know, side builds that I had going on in the overall mock. Um, so yeah, uh, without further ado, the date. Uh, this is a quite lovely little mock that I made. Uh, I forget how long ago, a couple months at least. Uh, but yeah, this uh, really challenged my building techniques and styles and things. Uh, and it all started ultimately with this little this little television here. I found it uh, stuck to the inside of another purchase uh, from uh, from eBay, believe it or not. Uh, it was a, from a, a knockoff block, um, something that I'll feature in another video. But yeah, this was stuck to the inside plastic of that, and I figured out that it was Lego, based on the hands, and uh, which set it came from. And while I couldn't really get that set per se, I decided to build something a little bit better. So I made a little TV stand, uh, a rotating TV on top, I guess, or maybe they're just lifting it up because uh, and moving it slightly because I don't think a lazy Susan would have been able to move those big TVs from back then. Um, yeah, over there uh, we have these. Oh, I'll just take that off. Uh, we have the lovely couple going on a nice little date. Um, they're uh, they're holding hands and they're looking at each other quite coyly, not really paying attention to the. Oh, Whoa, the horrible disfigurement I just did. Sorry about that. Uh, not paying attention to the uh, television screen. Uh, some newscaster, I guess. They don't really care. They're uh, focusing on each other's eyes. Oh, how lovely. Um, uh, yes, uh, anyway, uh, over here next to the TV, we have this lovely uh, plant stand that I that I thought was really, really creative because ultimately it's a, a inverse build, something that you don't see that often. Uh, I had to use a inverted uh, uh, slope build and uh, well, yeah, you can see what I did. Uh, basically, just uh, using a well, this is this is a uh, round uh, plate with a hole in it in the middle, and I stuck a uh, just a round just round stud on the bottom, and to allow it to stick to the plate. Uh, so yeah, ultimately, this is a very simple scene that you can pull together using uh, just a, a minor amount of uh, bricks. Very cute. I really enjoy the scene. I enjoy having it up on my shelf and. Uh, and just kind of thinking, you know, what else I can add to this scene? Give it, make it more of a 70s feel, you know? Uh, maybe a terrible rug or something. Or a coffee table. Uh, so yeah, you may see these guys again in the future uh, if I ever decide to add anything else onto it. Hopefully you had a good time, and uh, as much of a good time as I had building these guys, uh, please leave a like and subscribe, and uh, I will see you next time. Bye!